Yo, what is going on guys? King Kopa here, and today we're bringing you another Sword and Shield tutorial video. Um, in the last video we did, we showed you guys how to get a Gi Gigantamax Charizard, which is not available until the post game. In today's video, we're going to be doing something that anyone can do no matter where you're at in the game. I'm going to show you guys today how to easily get a high level and or rare raid battle in Pokemon Sword and Shield. First thing you need to do, you're gonna need to do is you're gonna need to be in the wild area. Now, what make the, what will make this easier is if you have beaten the game. If you've beaten the game, unfortunately, um, you will have an easier time with this. But we're gonna cycle around here for a moment. I'm gonna see where. So once you've beaten the game, um, you'll be able to easier collect these things called watts, and watts are this thing that allow you to buy things called wishing pieces so if you look here I can talk to this right here and it'll give me 200 watts um, I can then so now I have enough it's it costs 3,000 wishing pieces for or 3,000 watts for a wishing piece excuse me now I can then fly over to any marked location so I could fly here I could fly here it has to be in the wild area though if it's not in the wild area then it will not work so I'm gonna go ahead and fly over to East Lake Axwell and I'm going to go ahead and talk to this person right here. And he'll give you the option to spend your watts, right? So he'll give you the option to spend your watts. I'm going to spend it on a wishing piece. You do need 3,000 watts. It is very hard to do without um, having... It is a lot harder to do if you have not beaten the game. Because if... Here, I'll show... I'll, what's a good example? I'll show you guys if I can. Like, if I go over to this one over here, will I be able to show you guys? Or did I spawn that one in? I think I spawned that one in, so I won't be able to show you guys there, but if I go to any raid with a high or with a beam shooting out of it, meaning there is a raid ready, then I will get 2,000 watts, which puts me one step closer to being able to get it. So after you do that, we're going to go ahead and we're going to talk to this empty den. So you see how there's no glowing around it, nothing at all. We're going to throw a wishing piece in. It's going to ask us to save our game, and then it'll activate a beam of the light. Yeah, you see, as, as before, there is no beam of light there anymore, meaning I have, that I've already, that I was the one who did that. So we're going to go ahead and talk to this, and as you guys can see, we did get a five-star Noctowl. Now, if I go ahead and show you guys, let's jump into the raid battle here real quick, and I will show you guys how difficult these raid battles can be. We're going to use our good old trusty Bolton Dixie. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and not do that. So this is one of the easiest ways to catch Pokemon, to fill out your decks, and have some fun with your friends. Um, I'm not going to invite others because I don't have anyone to join me, uh, unfortunately. But I am going to jump into this. It is a super easy way to fill out your decks, and it's a lot of fun. These are very difficult, so if you get a 5-star, please, please, please be sure to take your time. I didn't switch my Pokemon. This is going to be even harder. Basically, so this is a 5-star Noctowl, right? If I had anything that was super effective, which I don't, it's not going to do anything crazy. There's also a way to Dynamax your Pokemon, if you didn't know that. There's only a couple ways you can Dynamax your Pokemon, which is through... Ra you can do it through Raid Battles, you can do it in uh, Gym Battles, you can do it in Wi-Fi Battles. There's only three ways to do it. Three ways to do it. This is one of the cooler ways, in my opinion, just because you get to catch this Pokemon once you're done, and you could do this with your friends. Um, this is 100% one of the easiest ways to do it, though. If you can get wishing pieces, I know we were able to do it. Me and my friends were able to do it early on in the game um, very, very easily. So I would say this is definitely one of the easier ways to do it for sure. Actually, I'm just going to see if I can run. I don't think taking this on is going to be worth it for me. Because I did bring in the wrong mod, so it's just going to waste time. Let's see. Can I run? You can't escape. Okay. Well, we're going to keep on trying then. But this would be the easiest way to do and find raid battles. I know some of the times, I, as you guys can see on mine, um, we had like no raid battles available. This is the easiest way to get rare raid battles and tough raid battles. So I know like um, when we first started the game, we were like level maybe 20. We just started the game. Me, Cypher, and Karai. We got a three-star Axew when the first time Jimmy did a... Jimmy, AK being Cypher, did a, um... 
a raid battle like this. He did it through the wishing piece. It was one of the easiest ways to do it. And we got a really cool three-star action that we were able to level up very easily. This is also the easiest way to get EXP candies. Um, the only way to get EXP candies, if, I, if I'm not mistaken, which will very make like leveling up in this game very easy. I had, as you guys can see, I had that level 71 Charizard. That's because of the EXP candies. I did not use that thing in battle at all. Um, which I think is super cool. Yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and end it off here. Middle of raid battle. I just don't want to make you guys sit through all of this because it will take a very long time. Um, especially because this is a 5-star. The rewards for a 5-star, if you guys didn't know, will be a lot better than the rewards for something like a 3-star, 4-star, or 1-star, or 2-star even. Um, but yeah, the easiest way, um, there's, let me just recap. So the easiest way is to gain a bunch of watts, up to 3,000 at least, to get by one wishing piece. Then you go to an empty well, and you throw the wishing piece in there, and then it'll activate the beam of lightning and put a mon in there. Um, another way would be to allow yourself, or another way would be to beat the game, because then you gain watts easier, and you will almost always have a 5-star raid. Um, and last but not least, um, I would say the last easiest way that I haven't talked about with you guys <clears throat> would be to look on the online thing. If you have Nintendo Online, um, it will show you constantly um, these different raids that are going on. And I would say just try to join those, get to meet some people through that. Maybe add some people as friends. You never know who might, who could be a really dope person. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to add me, I'll leave my friend code below and see if I can get you guys in some of these raids if you guys aren't able to do these high-level raids. Um, I am playing the game quite a bit. I've already put, I believe, over two days' worth of time into this game, and I've, it's only been available for about three. So that gives you guys an, an estimate on how much I haven't been playing this game, which is not a lot. So I will see you guys later on. Today, probably, I am going to be doing a stream at about 1.30 a.m. PST. I'm going to be shiny hunting Galarian Meowth, which is going to be pretty late, but I'm still going to do it. And hopefully I'll see you guys in another one of these videos very soon. I just got the idea to do this video, and I was like, dang, I really want to do this. Um, just because a lot of people don't know about wishing pieces. Like, I had someone who had completely beaten the game ask me about what Watts did, and I told him about it, and I'm like, that's how we get wishing pieces. So it gave me, it sparked the idea um, to do this video to maybe help some of you guys get raids a lot easier. Maybe even a lot of harder raids easier. So yeah. Um, that'll be it you guys if you guys did enjoy be sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and we will see you guys hopefully in, in later streams and later videos peace